The newest way to explore Columbus is on a Segway I-2 personal transporter. David Weller, entrepreneur and Columbus history buff, kicked off Segway tours for city residents and visitors alike the first week of May. We're in his office just off of North High Street. 90, you know, 99% of the people haven't ridden a Segway, so uh, yeah. it's very cool. I mean, the tour, you know, part of it, 75% of it is cool, I get to ride a Segway. And then, uh, and then you, uh, I go, it's kind of, like, it's a walking, you know, basically it's a walking tour on the Segway. So we, yeah. go, from, we go from point to point, uh, you tell them about the, uh, the sites uh, in Columbus, and, and interesting anecdotes, and you, again, you get to, get to ride a Segway. The Segway tour lasts two hours and has over 50 points of interest, including Good Old Park, North Market, Columbus's new Huntington Stadium, and the Convention Center, the Segway Tour Headquarters. Okay. So why tour Columbus on a Segway? Well, um, right now there is no daily tour of Columbus. Uh, the, we're going to be based out of the uh, Greater Columbus Convention Center, and the Greater Columbus Convention Center is always very busy, and there's no opportunity for conventioneers and visitors to, to take a daily tour. Tours cost $55 a person, and there are some safety restrictions. For, yeah, for our tour, you have to be at least 16 years old, and there's also a weight limit. You have to be more than 100 pounds and less than 260, and these are just safety restrictions. Mm -hmm. And we, have a, we require that you sign a waiver and release prior to, prior to riding. Uh, but yeah, so minors are allowed to, uh, to ride as long as their parent or guardian you know, is there to sign, sign the waiver. Mm -hmm. For more tour information, visit www.segawaytoursofcolumbus.com.